Hey everybody, Paul Turner here from the DiscipleProject.net and PaulTurnerSpeaks.com with another weekly vlog, another week at camp. It's a beautiful day. We're going to go visit some students and find out their answer to the question of the day. Hey vlog, what's up? It's Autumn back at oh. you for the first night of, well, second night of Paul Turner's speeches, talks. <laughs> Hi Paul! <laughs> Stop eating like, like every single second of my life because I never stop eating. Not doing homework. Probably procrastinating. I do that a lot. No, I saw when I'm bored, I kind of like rip off my nails. Get it! I would say like trusting the wrong people is a bad habit. Um, chewing gum. I chew a lot of gum and my friends get annoyed because I chew with my mouth open. Drinking coffee! It's become a bad habit. I guess like you drink it during the morning, during the afternoon, during dinner, then you can't sleep, then you're stuck for the next day. And it's like a repeat. But actually, you know what? Actually, scratch that. Donuts. Those were some great answers from our campers, but I want to turn it around on you guys. What habit would you like to erase from your life? It could be a ministry habit, it could be a personal habit, whatever it is. Leave me some comments down below. I'd love to hear from you. Now, if I can offer you a little tip. Doing this question of the day for me is new for me this year. I, in the 17 years that I've been coming to camp here, I just came up with a new idea and said, look, now i got this great camera uh, and I have my editing skills and all that. I said, well, we're going to do this every day. We're going to do a little video vlog every day and the kids have really, really uh, drawn to it. So I encourage you, if you're doing a camp of your own, go ahead and try question of the day. But leave those questions uh, pretty specific. Don't leave them so open-ended uh, to where they have to think too much about it. But you make it pretty specific and they have answered really well. Now listen, for your youth group, you know what? You don't have to, you could do a video right before service. That may be a little bit tight. But what I would encourage you to do is post it on your Instagram and then simply go ahead and take a screenshot of the answers and then or just make slides with the answers on them with the questions see what they say uh, or have send it out as a text message and let kids text you back their video response and tell them say look I'm only taking video responses and then take those videos download them string them together and you have yourself your little question of the day but that's it for today guys I appreciate you guys joining me here at Life Youth Camp I hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, if you're brand spanking new to the channel thanks for being here I appreciate you checking out be sure to hit the subscribe button and you'll get videos like this in your inbox on a regular basis. Also, if you're a regular, I always appreciate your comments. Please be sure to hit the thumbs up button. Let me know you like the video and you want more of them. And uh, be sure to check out some of the other videos that I have on here uh, about my time at camp here. And if you're looking for a speaker for your next camp or retreat, please visit paulturnerspeaks.com. We'll see you guys in the next video.